What's going on, y'all? What is going on? Thank you for choosing once again. Click on the channel. This is Oya Boy. I'm simply going to do my job. Get the messages to the collective. Hope everybody got through tonight. Well, thank you for your continued support. Thank you for liking, sharing, subscribing, whatever you're doing to support the channel. All right, so let's see what we got. Uh, so we got some fake news coming in. Yeah, there could be some towers that's coming in. So let me see. Okay, so you're going to have some stability in placement. Okay, and this could be because of some love that you have. There is a completion to a cycle. So let's pull. Please, guys, only take what resonates. I'm only here to give it to you so you can have it. We're all stars in our own show. But this may or may not be for you. Mm -hmm. You could have been maybe codependent on something. Um, there's There was a blocker. Oh, yeah, this block, this block actually could have been due to some memories, maybe looking at some old photos, going back, reminiscing um, on the old times. Something about learning from the past and making new memories. Somebody is addicted to watching someone online, on camera, or looking at their pictures. Um, yeah, okay, and this could be the time you're actually healing your heart, healing from heartbreak. Being free from toxic relationships. Yep, didn't I say it? Somebody is like stalking, watching, lurking. Okay, whoever this person is. Whew. They focus in outward. Okay, they focus in outward. Something about this person, person's perception. Um, somebody could also be um, using something about the use of mirrors. Um, somebody could be trying to mirror you, your self-image, or are they also trying to project and reflect old wounds, maybe digging up something that could have been heartbreaking to you, okay? This is like, a this is a narcissist, okay? Something about you enabling this person and their boundaries. This person could have already stabbed you in your back. Um, maybe they want to do some shocking attack, so let's pull. Mm, this could be a girlfriend. Hey, um, what's up, bitch? Somebody's like a... a a fake friend here or somebody wants to uh, see what you're doing something about this person in a certain apartment complex okay so let's see what we got something about the way that a certain apartment complex is built someone may be able to watch or look at you um, do some angles and I was getting it what I was saying it this morning it was like uh Angles, points, or something. Something about angles and points. Mm -hmm. This could be somebody, you know, they go where the drinks go. They go where the blunt goes. Somebody's, like, following someone. Um, and this is somebody that could have been like, well, another person's trash and another person's treasure. Whoever this person is, they did get popped behind you. Um, or they was they were sleeping with somebody around you. They felt like you abandoned them. Okay, so they could have used something on the outside of you. Maybe you just felt like it was time to fly, heal your heart. Um, but this person was addicted to either your energy, your company. Yeah, something that was scripted was caught on camera. Okay, so this person may have called, you know, gaslit a situation um, and secretly recorded you. Maybe you didn't know that. So let's see. Yeah, broken bond. There is a friend here, a broken bond. Mm -hmm. You could have known this person since MySpace. Um, this person felt like they were secured with you or in your company because there could have been something that you was actually dealing with. This is one of them people where, you know, maybe you was going through something, you'll call this person. Be like, don't you know that I went through this? Okay, somebody has this uh, attachment to you. They feed off of your information that you give them or they feed off of your heartache or your pain. Something that you tell this person is what fuels this person up. Okay, this is why this person could actually be trying to project a mirror of something that you've already experienced in the past onto you. This person feels like they this is this person's last um, chance at something. So they could be charming at the time. They want to use you for either some type of deception or this person wants to do this. They want to get something scripted caught on camera. Mm-mm. Yeah, I feel like you have no connection to this person now. Um, this person was also withholding information. 
this. Whatever this person was doing, they was withholding information from you. So let's see. Yeah, this bitch thinks she's a running mate. Like, if you two was running for a certain position, she feels like she has to go up against you. Yeah, somebody feels like they got nothing to lose. Um, you're going to get whatever it is that you need. I feel like this could also be a man that's doing this. Okay, so you do have masculine energy, or she could be operating in her, her masculine side more. Um, yeah. Let me see. Yes, she was hidden among somebody. You, whatever person, whoever this is, she had a hidden beef. Mm hmm. Okay, so somebody is using like a fake address, or they don't actually live where you believe they live at. So this is one of those, somebody could have actually been camped up around you or they was um, given an apartment to be around you. This is almost like someone wanted to get, why am I picking up that somebody is connected to either uh, someone that's like a candidate for something or they uh, they know a political candidate? Something about water. Somebody's getting like free perks. If it's not actual, uh, something about this person. Okay. So this could be like a, a government, uh, what is it? Subsidized housing or something. Somebody's receiving something to, um, catch you on camera or go through your trash or script like a fake friendship. Mm hmm. Somebody could be actually cutting the line where you live at right now. This could be confirmation. <clears throat> something that this person is connected to uh washington or someone of a high rank okay something about stupid people and there's something about a free trade so let's see mm -hmm. somebody's trying to stage an event so you could go through like a no-knock warrant someone wants the police or uh, someone in law enforcement to come to your home okay so Whoever this female is, she is connected to somebody. So let's see. She could be, it's just this masculine energy could be in the background. Let me see. What's this fake address? Okay. Somebody was given a, a free apartment or a move in to watch someone. So you got a manager or boss or coworker. Someone took a payment to either use some documents to be um, either sent to a new address, a fake address, or address that's connected to somebody that's already a part of some scam in her. You could be cutting your line right now, figuring out who's who, who you had around you. Yes, somebody somebody was uh, given something. These people are part of like a, a sex ring or something. Whatever cult or group that they are part of, they like getting people through like fake interviews. Somebody could be promising someone a job or a certain position or career. This could be one of those false collabos. Okay, someone wants someone to come in to either give up some information or to appear on camera. There is a manager of some of company. Somebody took a payment to fake like an interview or get something scripted. Mm -mm. Let's see. Yeah, this person is not a friend. Um, somebody is into prostitution. Um, something about control over certain energies. So maybe this man is using this female to do like a recruit, uh, recruiting young, younger energies. This person could also work around children. Someone works around children. Mm -hmm. Someone's car is also in someone else's name. Okay, so you got it. Somebody has a vehicle and someone has an address. Both of these... Um, or not who this person is. It could be under a different name. So this is, here we go, fake news. Mm -hmm. So you got something about a foreign po politician here. Okay. You got middle America. Foreign politician, TSA airport. Okay. Yeah, Yeah, you just keep getting it. Whoever this is, is hidden among something. Um, this is a person, you don't believe that this person has some type of issue with you. Okay, so let's see. Somebody has already been caught together. Somebody could have been caught at the airport, going to the airport, going to a certain car lot, trying to uh, switch someone's name or the vehicle registration in someone else's name. Something heavy about this person's vehicle uh, and a name that the actual vehicle is registered in. 
the address, the address of this certain company or the address of where this person live at or where you live at. Something is scripted here and it's been caught on camera. Okay, so let me see. Mm -hmm. There could be a neighbor. This neighbor could be involved with something. These people know about your birthright. Somebody could have tried to bully you. You got bully, bulldog, Frenchie. Without further ado, they are screwed. All right, so let's pull. Mm -hmm. Someone's only upset because you have broken a bond with this person. Okay, this could be a neighbor. This could be you could have left a certain job. Um, you could have left whoever this man is. Somebody does have this whole um, empath narcissist bond, and it's like the the delusion of somebody to believe that after you experience a certain level of pain or you have experienced deception, that you would come back to this person knowing that something was all scripted. Somebody feels like they can find another way to get close to you again. Somebody was together and you didn't know it. All right, so let's see. This could have been a friend and an ex. Mm -hmm. Somebody's also been getting a lot of readings done, okay? So this is, uh, somebody's getting a lot of readings done on you. This could be somebody that wants to know what your next move is, what you're doing, um, how they can find a way. Did I say something? So this is what it is, okay? This fake address is fake moving. Somebody is dealing with a community and there is some decoy neighbors or somebody that will send in just to simply watch you um, project, do some type of witchcraft, script something, catch it on camera. <sighs> yeah, this there's a masculine that's way too feminine. Um, this could be uh, your confirmation. Somebody that has played in your energy for so long. Now they have lost, you know, that masculine energy. Oh, somebody crypt cuz. Yeah, somebody's practitioner is revengeful. So mm -hmm. this person could be on social media. Somebody's doing a, a witchcraft. They connected to a foreign politician. It just keeps coming out. Yep, so what's this other lie? Way too feminine. You're gonna know who it is. This, the youngins need a spiritual gunner. Yep, you got running mate. Okay, so somebody could be connected to his foreign politician, whoever these people are. Um, something about a Cadillac. Somebody is um, involved in like the porn, porn industry. Let me get some more cards because when this start getting silly like this, let's see what we got. Um, something about your artistic expression. There's a chain reaction that's happening. Um, there's an editor here. Something about something being supernatural. What's a Plymouth? Uh, oh, Lord. Rosemary, baby. Somebody could be into watching like a lot of horror films. Because I get the, the heel, a uh, heel on the house. The heels have ass. Special effects. Witchcraft. Okay, so somebody could be pregnant and somebody wants to actually disturb somebody's pregnancy with a form of witchcraft. Do not let this person touch you, rub your belly. Something about somebody is really upset. Cause so maybe this is what it is, okay? Because this is usually how it works. You you grow, you start moving towards your your actual um position in life. Um, you may have gotten married, you may have gotten pregnant, you may have, you know, kicked an addiction, you may no longer want to party or be out or be seen anymore. Maybe your home is where your, your heart is, so that's where you are. And somebody is like really jealous of it. This person wants to do something to somebody's pregnancy. This is how sick they are. This person wants to corrupt somebody's pregnancy. Something about the hairs on the back of this person's neck is going to stand up because the ancestors is already on her ass. And we watched receiving gifts from this person. Something about you could have received a gift from this person already and you was disappointed. This was because this was a fake gift. This gift was coming in with some bad energy. Whatever this person already did to whatever this is this person gave to you, 
Um, it was for someone to have an accident. Okay, so somebody could already be accident prone. Maybe you clumsy or something like that. This person could have gave you something. Um, maybe you started, you know, dropping your coffee on your, your blouse in the morning. Uh, maybe you started tripping up on stuff, leaving keys. Something about what this person gave you is is like her her mini portal to your home. Most definitely do not accept a mirror from this person or some cosmetics or some glasses, sunglasses, something weird that she's playing with has some type of binding or tie, something about this person and tying things up. Okay, so whoever's female is, she could be addicted to you, literally. You may not have known this person has been a snake, but she's been getting reads done on you for the longest time. She also could be into, like, the porn industry or prostitution. Maybe she's into sex work. You know, people do what they do. If they want to twerk for work, that's just on them. Um, but maybe you did something different and this person's upset. Maybe I was doing it together at first and now this, somebody's like, yeah, she's somebody else. What else she doing? She wants you to be physically limited. So this is one of them people, you know, you get into an accident or something. The same person that wished this accident on you wants to come and be the one to take care of you. They want to push your wheelchair, feed you, feed you stuff. Somebody's really toxic when it comes to their friendship. And I feel like you already got like freedom from this person. And you need to focus because this person's trying to figure out how she can blindly attack you again. That's crazy. This is somebody that's also like, I don't have no mother and I don't have no man and I don't have to. This is somebody that could always talk about what she don't have. Even if she has a lot, she talks about what she don't have. I don't have a car. I don't have this. I don't have that. It's just like she wants to see through your eyes or experience something through your eyes. So, something about this person is really strange. This is why I was getting split earlier. The personalities, maybe she got nine of them. And all nine of them are dumb as hell. Every personality that she has is fake. Something that you could have uh, came down with a cold or a flu. Out the blue. Yeah, somebody wanted someone to have the perfect excuse to stay home and focus on them. It's like even if you have children, she wants you to focus on her. Something really weird. It's even be a man. Take it how it go. Yeah, something about fatigue, illness, and the lack of. She could be sick right now. Wow. Head hurting, friends are mad at you. Okay, so this could be what she feels like. Her friends are mad at her or you do. It's just work. That's all. You got to do it if you need to. Something about maybe you didn't let anything that you was dealing with physically or spiritually interfere with what you you knew mentally. You didn't make excuses for yourself. Hell, yeah, you could have been like me. You worked all the way up. You worked through your full pregnancy. Somebody was jealous of it. Something about a leak. All right, so let's keep going. You got something about a... Uh, Parenting. This person, oh Lord, somebody's pregnant by their best friend, man. I ain't why we ain't got nothing to do with that. But it's like this person may have lost a child that she had with somebody that she was sleeping with. This is why I was getting somebody was getting popped behind somebody. And it's crazy because I had one of them dreams, y'all wake up. You know how when you wake up in the sleep. Like I woke up in this uh I was getting out of bed. And I turned around, and this this chick I used to, you know, mess with, like, we was cool. She was laying in the bed. So I'm like, why are you in the bed smiling and shit, and you don't even like me? It's like whoever this girl is has followed behind you spiritually for the longest time. Maybe you didn't know she was in your energy. Maybe you didn't know what she was into. Yep. She had a spirit replaced because she was either trying to replace you in your own story but now they don't know who they are. She was also trying to make a sacrifice here. Whatever sacrifice she was trying to make, it was either for you to look like a prostitute or she wanted you to prostitute with her. Um, something about she was pressured into having fake happiness. This could have been somebody that could have had children, but she was really depressed and sad. 
Mm -hmm. Something about she wants someone to have a, a, a labor full of sorrow because maybe she did. She didn't heal from this heartbreak. Mm -hmm. She's looking back, holding on. This is who's uh, looking at these old pictures of you. Uh, maybe she's looking at old videos of you. Somebody's addicted to a day friend. Uh, this bitch is weird. Yeah. Yeah, she's been using someone else's name for clout. Okay, whoever she is, she's a girl with a snake. Okay, this could also be a trans energy. Whatever she was doing was self-serving. Um, yeah. Something about her been trying, she's been trying to manifest something to happen. And why do I keep getting, she's pretending not to know, okay? So you got B, C, D, F, G, H, J, K. This is somebody that follows the drinks, the drugs, the thugs, and has no love. She is located on a low astral level. Her soul is undeveloped. Her soul is dead. She's like, that. why would you go? You the light. Her character's already changed. She could already still play like the victim, but now you aware that she got lethal habits. Mm -hmm. She's having some karma out loud. Yeah, so something about you taking your vitamins, sipping your tea, do not drink something from this person. She's still connected to a negative energy. Okay. Yeah, something about she could have also stolen somebody's uh, deceased loved one's items. Well, she's been using and wearing certain people's items that are deceased in order for her to energy stop siphoning harvest. What's your message?